Hey everyone, hey brothers and sisters. Amanda Seyfried is a famous actress. She's famous in this world. She is winking here for the eye of Horus, one eye symbolism. It's as simple as that. If you think about it, winking is either having a secret or it's something sexual. Use your discernment to what this is. Using a flower to darken one's eye is something that the enemy does a lot in this world. This is not something glorifying Jesus Christ, our Lord God and Savior. It is the opposite of that. It's about secrets. It's about the occult. One-eye symbolism. Wink, wink, nudge, nudge. Part of the club, right? Amanda Seyfried's doing the slam dunk pose of the Eye of Horus, where she darkens one eye utterly, covering half her face, doing one-eye symbolism. She's keeping the vow of silence about the biblical world and about fame, fortune, and success and how that all works. Again here. And Amanda Seyfried is hiding her hand the way a Freemason would do. Many people will tell you different stories about life, but the god of Freemasonry is Lucifer, the light bearer. They think he's the hero and liberator. He is not. He is Satan, the father of lies, and the world is this deceived. No, really, the world is this deceived. Knowing this stuff has helped me in my life years ago and still today to know Jesus Christ and have salvation to humble myself before the Lord God and Savior of the entire world and to reject things of this world, to reject the flesh, to reject celebrities, to reject what they do, hidden in plain sight. Amanda Seyfried, no one knows what's going on here, but she's hiding her hand the way a Freemason would do. The God of Freemasonry is Lucifer the light bearer, who is Satan, the father of lies, it is up to you, the viewer and my listener, my brother and sister, hopefully, that you reject what this is. You know what it is so you can avoid it and you can call it out for what it is. It is satanic. The world is satanic. It's a good thing that there's the good news of the gospel of truth of our Lord Jesus Christ. His death, burial, and resurrection, according to the scriptures, is for salvation, forgiveness, and much, much more. The promises of God. Or you can deny all that, be entertained by the world, which is hidden in plain sight, right? These signs and symbols mean nothing. This is a conspiracy theory channel, but it is not. This channel here is for me and my brother and sisters to fellowship on and to expose and reprove and shine light on the world. People need to know this so they can make the decision to stay in the world and live by the flesh or to deny it, hate the world, because if you love the world, the love of the Father is not in you. It's hard to describe this, but I do in fact hate the world. I hate lies and deception. I want the truth. I am not someone going out of my way so I can do anything other than serve God and tell the truth. Many people will call this judgment it is pointing out people that are choosing the wrong path, the left-hand path in life, which is satanic, so you can know what it is and hopefully reject it and find truth in Jesus Christ alone. Walk with him, pick up your cross daily, put on the full armor of God, trust in the finished work of Jesus Christ, our Lord God and Savior, and not celebrities or anything else that hide their hand in their coat the way Freemasons do. God bless you, everyone.